Welcome everyone, it's March 19th, about two o'clock in the afternoon. I just wanted to give you an update on what is happening in the town of Prescott Valley uh, in regards to our response to the coronavirus. Effective three o'clock today, the town, the, the Civic Center will be closing its doors to the public, but that necessarily doesn't mean that our essential staff will continue to work. So that means you will have access to water bills, permitting, the court, anything you need, you just need to contact them via email or via phone number. So uh, depending on who you are, if you wanted to call the court, contact 772-8277. Or if you just had a general question about what is going on, contact 759-3000. And they'll be able to direct you to the correct department. Also, our police department is going to be closed to the public as well. So there's a phone outside the, the police department. You can just pick it up. It'll get you either to records department or to non-emergency dispatch and you can explain to them what's going on and we'll be able to help you out. So I just wanted to just reaffirm things are still going with the town of Prescott Valley. Nothing is changing. We will still have personnel out on the streets fixing any issues that we may have and we will be going and performing business as usual. One of the things I want to make sure you guys check out is on the town of Prescott Valley's website. It's pvaz.net. And once you go to it, you'll be able to click on coronavirus and then you'll be able to go through it. And it has all of our resources in regards to what's going on. State health, federal, the pandemic response plan that we have, our town resources, police resources, basically every question that you could possibly have about what's going on will be updated on this, on this site. So also another site I want you to pay attention to and that we are directing people to is the Arizona Department of Health Services. It's azdhs.gov. And there you'll be able to just monitor the number of positive outbreaks, as well as the pending tests, as well as those that have been tested. And as a reminder, the Avapai County has yet to have a positive test here in our county. So with that being said, I want you to know, also I was at Walmart earlier, I spoke to the, the store manager, and yes, folks, they had eggs, they had meat, they even had toilet paper on their shelves. So please, please make sure you get out there if you need something, only buy what you need for the next month. Don't overdo it and save some for the rest of the community. And also, if you cannot get out, if there's a problem at home, if you have transportation issues and you're just starting to feel a little bit of anxiety and panic, give us a call, 759-3100, or also email us at thecomrel at pvaz.net and just let us know what your issues are, your concerns are, and we will make sure that you get in touch with the right services so we can get through this. Again, folks, our office is always open for any comments or questions, and just rest assured, we will get through this, as I've mentioned before, Prescott Valley Strong. Talk to you soon, and we will continue to give you updates. Thanks, everyone.